Now I would like to show you very important information in Swayam that I will go to the about the course to about to, to know about credit of this course, outline uh, layout of this course and certificate how to obtain certificate from this course. This is a course layout which means 12 weeks uh, course and each week the topics covered will also be given in this case. Here summary the course status ongoing and the course uh, the, uh, the the key points of the course is given the course type is selective duration start date end date exam date is also given and enrollment ends date is also given and category level undergraduate and postgraduate this is an ACT approved FTP faculty development program uh, course is it, this is also for students it can transfer uh, credit to the uh, records of the student for faculty it is a faculty development program also okay so very importantly come down here it's a course certificate how to obtain course the criteria of getting a certificate the criteria of getting certificate once you join uh, enroll to the soyam course you can freely learn without any interruption there is no admission fees in the soyam you can learn as you want and you can join the number of courses as per your wish but one thing I can suggest from my personal experience simply do not join to any courses unless you decide to complete that course just because once you join to the course there is no option in the soyam portal that you cannot exist from that course unless you complete even if you complete the course it won't go from your dashboard it will remain forever okay so simply do not join now let us see how to obtain that uh, course certificate so as, as i told you learning is free in soyam if you want certificate the course is free to enroll and learn uh, from this soyam but if you want certificate you have to register and write the proctor exam proctored exam conducted by nta, NTA. So conducted by us in a person you want to attend in a person a designated exam center which will be allotted by the respected proctored exam examination. The exam is optional for fee 1000 rupees. If you want certificate you have to pay 1000 rupees per course. So not now in the 1000 rupees is not same for all the courses. There are some courses which can have only 500 rupees and one very very important uh, thing you want to know once you clear that course the amount will be refunded to your bank account. I have personally refunded my uh, amount which I take an exam and passed that exam only if you pass the exam if you do not pass the exam the amount won't refund to you okay if you pass the exam the amount will refund also there is a relaxation for uh, com community basis why it will become to know while you are registering to the exam and here it is a uh, exam date is also given and timing also given there will be two session in the uh, a, a exam that's a morning 9 a.m to 12 noon and afternoon 2 p.m to 5 p.m very important information i can give you while you are joining to the soyam course please opt for two courses at a time so if you select two courses uh, exam if you take exam two courses at a time uh, once of morning slot evening slot you can take a uh, preference according to your wish if you go for one courses the slot will be decided by the proctor and one more thing if you opt for two courses at a sing in a single day okay they then in the same exam center you can write both courses that is one more opportunity for you okay so now criteria to get certificate very importantly we have to understand this to award score the criteria what is the criteria i will uh, look at here average assignment score uh, it means in from the assignment 25 percent will be taken from the assignment 75 percent will be taken from the exam you write uh, you wrote okay so assignment average assignment score 25 percent of uh, average of best eight assignment look at the look at the advantages of uh, soyam you are going to attend 12 assignment some of the time you are unable to attend some of the 
weekly assignment so out of a 12 assignment only best eight assignment will be considered for waiting for awarding score which means uh, from assignment level uh, so 25 percent will be awarded to the final score and best eight assignment will be up to from 12 assignment okay so exam score is 75 final score would be average assignment score which means 25 percent of eight best assignment and plus exam score which will be final score for you so very importantly you should uh, get, uh, take note that you will be eligible for a credit uh, certificate only if average assignment score greater than 10 out of 25 and in the in the assignment and 30 out of 75 in the exam score which means 25 marks is reserved for assignments out of 25 marks you should oh, you should earn at least 10 marks otherwise you, you won't be awarded a certificate and in the final score out of 75 questions 75 marks at least you should earn 30 marks which means the 10 plus 30 40 percent you should earn so any one of the criteria you are not going to meet means you won't get certificate final score should be greater than 40 out of 100 and very importantly only e certificate will be made available for you you have to take a print out whether color print out or whatever hard copy won't be dispatched to you so this is the overview of swayam mooc course and swayam is a best 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 online portal for learning which uses multimedia and which makes the learning comprehension enriched and the prominence and eligible faculty that you teach most of you may be suffering that you are not uh, studied in a very good institution so you may feel like that but look at this person who is a instructor for this business statistics he is a pro by professor mukesh kumar barua he is a professor at iit roorkel so iit roorkel is a first iit in india iit professor iim professor and the best IGNO professor, best university professor are teaching to you in the Soyam MOOC course. And just look at the learners offer this course. 5,747 learners are registered for this course. It shows the importance of Soyam MOOC course. I hope the, I hope I have given more clarity regarding Soyam. Thank you for watching and please comment your opinion and also subscribe to my Vision Academy YouTube channel. Thank you so much.